tell you about what I'm going to do another video. I'm trying to do about actually exploring this abandoned, abandoned mail house. And there's also a car on the driveway and a couple of bits and pieces. I'm going to be leaving any information about this location down in the description and also link to my Facebook page. Let's see what we can find out about exploring the abandoned mail house. The history and location of the abandoned mail house. The person who lived here was called Alan Lewis. A bit ironic. Um, there was loads of paperwork and also unopened letters sculled high on the top of the kitchen sink. There was quite a lot of spider webs, so the property hasn't been lived in for a very long time. Sadly, the person who lived here, called Alan, had a dog, and there was also a metacam on top of the kitchen counter. I couldn't see any dates on the metacam, but the metacam can be used for a good couple of years, as I've got dogs of my own and needed to use metacam at some parts of their stages for pain relief. Um, the property itself has got calendars dated at around 2021 and also 2022, so the property hasn't been left empty for that long, but it looks like it's been left empty for even longer, as the bed mattress is absolutely in a covered in state of decay. Upstairs is even more worse, and one of the bedrooms is absolutely chopper blocked with the person's belongings who Alan lived at. One of the bedrooms is absolutely pristine condition. I have no idea how this bedroom is still in good condition, but let's go and see what we can find out of exploring the abandoned mail house.
Tony Chick's almost abandoned house of mail. This place is absolutely jam-packed with mail. Um, actually, the person who lived here was actually called Lewis. So very right, ironic. But I'm going to be leaving any information about the location in the description. And the person who actually owned this house actually had that dog behind me. But yeah, what a creepy location this was. Spider webs are everywhere. But I'm going to be leaving any information about the location down below in the description. And also a link to my Facebook page where I'll be uploading photos from this location. And if our location has been to Brooks Foreign Journey, don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you in a video soon. Over and out. Bye. Hello people and thank you for watching my video. And if you'd like to turn the bell on for notifications so you won't need to miss any videos which I upload and don't forget to subscribe if you're new and also don't forget to follow me on my social medias the links will be in the description down below you can follow me on my Facebook page Twitter Instagram snapchat and also thank you for watching once again and I'll see you in another video over and out bye